Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz, and that, that's Kevin. He's running around. He's my little tamed aphid that I tamed up and grounded. Do you like his house? I'm gonna feed him. Come here, Kevin. Kevin, come eat. Don't run around out there. There's spiders. They want to eat you, but not me. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even, wouldn't even think about eating an aphid. <laughs> not even just a little bit of, of eating one. Yeah, maybe these are grubs, not aphids, Kevin. There you go, bud. Yeah, check it out. He's eating. He's eating. There's a different one. You're coming in here. Why would you come in here? He's coming in here to steal Kevin's food. I knew it. Look at him go. <laughs> good boy. Yeah, it was a good little aphid. Yeah, you are. <laughs> anyway, guys, we are doing something fun today. I need to unequip that. We're gonna, where'd the goggles go? I don't know where the goggles went. Anyway, guys, let's switch out that for this. We want to equip them the new goggles today. Yeah, there he is. There goes Kevin. And I don't know what that one's doing, but it did just poop aphid juice out, which I can eat. It's kind of exciting. And yum, yum, yum. Anyway, so check out our castle that we've been building. We have to make sure we're continuously making more and more and more bricks. And you guys told me that I need to put in the uh, the red mushrooms instead of the gray mushrooms in there. That way I get more mushroom juice out of it and I can make more bricks. Or I need to harvest the red ones instead. That's the word I'm looking for. But we are building up this castle and I really like how these new mushroom blocks look. They're pretty cool, pretty exciting. And now I have to try to figure out what I'm actually gonna do with this place. You've also gotta remember that we're in survival mode, so building anything is just gonna take an insane amount of time. Maybe we'll get it done today, I hope we will. I've set about five hours aside so I can take care of this. So how's that kind of look for a start? Maybe it's a little bit too, too wide? I do kind of like that though. We got little, I don't even know what these circly boys are called on the side. A little bit of thing up in the front center. I can do it. We're gonna we're gonna build this up there and then there and there. Maybe that'll be okay. I'm also drowning. Not drowning. I have no drink. I have literally zero to drink. Oh no! See, <laughs> that's gonna be one extra thing too. I'm gonna have to make all of the resources and everything here. So all of the dew collectors and all of that fun stuff. This is gonna take an insane amount of time to make all these. Wow! But I will do it for you. Yes, I will, as long as you leave the like on this video. Drink or die. That's how he's nice of them to say. Let's slurp up that nasty water, which makes me stupidly hungry. So I'll just slam some dirty mushrooms in my mouth hole. And I also had those grubs I can consume. Nice. Oh, Kevin pooped. That was nice of him. Thanks, Kevin. I like eating Kevin's poop. It's good for me. All right, so me and Kevin have been busy. Mainly him just messing up everything. You're just kind of like burrowsing, bur burrowsing? I made up a new word, it's called burrowsing. Yeah, <laughs> we've been grinding up a ton of these mushrooms. Uh, it's not gonna lie, it's been a lot already. But I kind of have started up a back area here. I wanted you guys to see it before I kind of got going on it. So I thought to myself, I said, self, let's put in these things up here. And those are the clover leaves. I think the clover leaf would look very good with it. And in here, I'm not exactly sure what to do, but I kind of like having some high turrets up on the top, having all of our, our farms down on the sides, having another turret that I can't reach the second story, and then like a big house area. I think that'd be kind of cool, but I couldn't find any rounded floors. So I'm not exactly sure. I know those are walls, but the floor, there was no rounded floor. So I don't really want to like make a, put a square in a round peg hole. Is that, no? What's the word for that? Put a square pig in a round hole. That's what it is. Yeah, but we can't we can't do that here because it's circle on the backside. So yeah, it, uh, it's gonna look pretty cool, I think, if I put all these in. Look at that. Yeah, that arch in there is really cool. Plus, I would have like a natural like area with grass growing up. I think that's amazing. Also, uh, those things spawned <laughs> right here. I've had them spawn on the floor. I also had a wolf spider spawn in the house. So that's weird. At least Kevin is safe. So if I remember right, these things require like a single weed stem. Yeah, they do. They require a single weed stem and then a buttload of clover on it. Do I have any clover in the chest? No, but I do have one spoiled meat, which means I can start growing this one up. Very cool. And I know that I can put in fertilizer, but I don't have any. So we'll just wait with it. They do take a long time. I just need to collect a whole bunch of clover. And then I can slop the clover up top. Ooh, that is gonna look really good. If I can reach it. <laughs> oh, nice. 
Oh, cool. I did it all in one jump. All right, let's look how this looks. Kevin, get back inside, dude. It's dangerous out here. Okay, that does look really cool, especially since we're in, like, a clover field right now. Yes, I love that. I know it's square, uh, but it still looks flared around the outside, so we're going with it. Oh, look, Kevin pooped. He's so nice like that. I can eat it, and it's amazing. Consume that honeydew aphid. Aphid honeydew. Oh, I saw you. I saw you coming in here. I'll kill him next time. Nicely, of course. I wouldn't. I mean, we don't want to be mean to our guests. Oh! Speaking of things spawning in the base. Wow. <laughs> what are you guys doing here? I didn't make dinner yet. You weren't supposed to come over quite now. Yeah, they're all up inside the base. Bunch of turd nuggets. I haven't even been picking them all up, but there's already 19. Oh, 29. <laughs> 29 of the larva faces. Thankfully, there are a bush bunch of mushrooms out here. Man, words are hard for my face to talk today. Okay. There's a lot of red mushrooms out here that I can easily collect, which is really, really nice. There's no wood over here, though. None at all, ever. Oh, yeah, that's going to look amazing. Big old turrets popping up out of the clover forest. Can you imagine being an adult, like, walking through here and stepping on, like, this mushroom brick house castle thing? So I guess I can put in a bunch of the floors inside the house, too. And I did want to make these new spiral steps, but they're going to take a lot of acorn shells, so I'll have to go grab those in a little bit. I really just wanted to get rid of the junk lying around, clean up the base a little bit, make it nice and tidy. So Kevin doesn't get in any more trouble. Well, the smoothie worker has been working absolute overtime today. And uh, I'm making up a ton of bricks in, in here, as you can imagine. Needing a ton of bricks to make a really, really cool tower. And check it out. Uh, it's, it's actually coming along pretty well. I've got most of the wall done. And we still need... There's going to be... Yeah, that's... I still need a lot of bricks for that. <laughs> Not going to lie. But I do have this really cool tower on the top coming up. And I'll show you that here as I go up and build some more. I got these staircase done, the acorn stairs. And I still need to finish this off. But once I get up to this floor, I'm really, really liking this. I've got a little balcony area that I can look down and throw things at intern. And I can even walk along the side here and jump onto the top of that roof. I think it's coming along really, really well. Unfortunately, it is nighttime, though, so we have that going for us. So I wanted to try out some of these roofs on here and see what you guys think. We have the squared corner, and we also have the roof corner. That one's, that one's the, I don't even, I don't know the difference. I don't know the difference between a squared corner. So I'm just going to try these on the corners. Okay, that doesn't look too bad at all. Kind of the same theme as what we've been going on uh, otherwise, too. And is there just a regular, or there it is, the clover roof. Check that out. Does that work? I feel like that works. I dumbed it up. You, you that one didn't go in right. Uh, just, and then, and then right, and then there it is. Oh, cool. And then can I just put a, a flat boy on the top? Would that work? Oh, dirty. Oh, dirty, my gurdy. This is where I'm going to, this is where my house is going to be up here in this cool room. And now I just need a buttload of clover. I, I have three clovers on here. I need a buttload of clover and a bunch of stems. And then a absolute massive amount of mushroom blocks. And I'm really sad inside. Like, in my heart, it's sad. Because I do not know where the second, um, what is it called? The second one of these things, charcoal for the oven is. I don't know where I put it. I, oh, nighttime. I don't know where it went. I've searched out all of my chests and I cannot find it. So I can't have two ovens going. And I've been back two other times to the respawn point and it is not responded. So I'm just going to have to like hang out and wait for a long time until this thing finishes. Good news, everyone. Intern has found some very, very interesting things. Yes, that's right. Intern is here helping me out somewhere. He's inside of there. I'm just going to put these down so he can't go anywhere. Yeah, that's right. Now, now he's stuck in the corner. Oh, he also forgot how... No. He also forgot how to make these. I'll teach him. Actually, I can't because I don't have any inventory space. But the really good news, what I was trying to tell you, is that intern found more stuff for an oven. He found two more charcoals, which is great because I searched the world over and thought I found true love, but there wasn't any true love because intern threw things at me. Ha, got him. And he's got extra bonuses in there that I can use to go <gasps> maybe you can get out of my way no ow wow these things take 20 I had no idea that they take 20 each okay I need more boiling glands where I, I know I had their boiling glands and then we got 10 more is that enough yes boiling glands it did it wait I got both of them they're both done 
<laughs> it's been it's been hours. It's been hours, my friends. Like literally like seven days. I'm kidding. It's been hours though. I even was doing things like building decorations. I mean <laughs> whatever build decorations in a game, not me. But the good news is I still do have plenty of toadstools, so we have that going for us. We'll just craft you up in there and craft you up in there. Now I'm making so many bricks, I'm so excited. I almost need another grinder, but I think that should be pretty good. I'm gonna also move this. I don't know where I'm moving that. I don't really ever use it. Mushrooms have grown. We have this really cool bedroom up here and it's full of nothing. It's usually the way I do games. It's like I make up this really cool looking thing from the outside and inside there's literally nothing there. And he's just murdering something in the basement again. What are you doing here? That wasn't even in the basement. I'm gonna poke it. There, I killed it all by myself. Still, oh, that was gross. Well, my friends, I have good news and bad news. Good news is the castle is mostly done with a few minor decoration things left. Bad news is Kevin ran away. Kevin's gone. He straight up disappeared. I don't know, maybe a wolf spider ate him, which could, or maybe that's, that could be Kevin. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll just not talk about that, but check this out. Are you excited? I'm excited. Okay, I'm gonna just jump up on this and then turn around and ta-da! Look at that place, how neat it is. Look at intern, he's gonna be playing with the ant. Yeah, we totally need, I, I'm thinking we need some sort of animal face right there. Like maybe a big ladybug head. Oh, how big is that? Oh, no, no, how do I? Ah, <laughs> I can't do it. Good thing I could just jump on the roof from the other side. Oh yeah, that'll be perfect. Except they literally have nothing to build it with. So it looks like we gotta go find a ladybug. There he is. There's Mr. Lady, Mrs. Ladybug. I, don't, I feel like that's a bug's life situation. It's both like, it's a ladybug, but it might be a male. Yeah, oh, 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 no. oh, epic block. How'd you like that? I bet he did. Oh, hot dang, that was, <laughs> these things hit so hard. He just broke my chest plate too. Thankfully that is, wait, we didn't get a ladybug head off of him? There, I mean, I see it, why can't I pick it up? I just got the parts and a spider fang, but he didn't have the spider fang. But I found another ladybug. Uh oh, oh no, my ax broke. What a terrible time for my axe to break. Hey, hey, how are you? How are you, ladybug? Okay, just poke. I, maybe I can't even hit, I'm just incompetent at attacking. Where are you going, ladybug? I feel like it might be, might have spawned in the fence. That's funny. Don't hit me in turn. Thank you. Okay, ladybug, ladybug head. Now I am stuck too. Look, we caught an ant. Oh, we have a pet ant now. He's our worker ant. I don't know what he does, but he's he's being our pet ant. All right, let's put that ladybug head up here. Oh, that looks so cool. Look, I got a ladybug head. Oh yeah, that looks nice. Also at nighttime, we put up a ton of torches. So this place just glows really well. Looks super cool. So there's also this item, which is a brand, well, relatively brand new. It's just a simple bed, but it uses the crow feathers. So it's kind of a neat thing. I'm not sure where to put it. I like this area. Compared to, this actually would be a nice spot right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It takes a lot of resources though. Worth it. On second thought, I'm gonna move it over here because <laughs> that's probably a better spot for it. Then I can have one over here and in turn can have one right over here. Why would you Why would you think that being at a triangle is a good idea game? And we could put some nice weapon wall mounts above our bed, like right there. How cool is that? And a nice little berry chair here too. We don't want it to be too annoying to come up the stairs. I think that would be cool though. I also thought we could maybe, ooh, acorn fences? What? I forgot about fences. We could also put something stuffed in here like a stuffed ladybug. I know they're gigantic though. I feel like maybe just like a little, an aphid and then maybe like a mite or something. Yeah, that might, that's actually kind of gross. Stuffed mites, terrifying. We should do a starf larval. These things are so annoying. They're all over here. So they spawn and they're just eating me alive. Do not. My big ax is dead. Much like your friend. This one's not even smart enough to know how to go around grass. I think my other weapon just broke. Are you kidding me right, Meow? I gotta chase him down with my fist to punch him in the butt. 
And then we'll put a couple of these on the bed and some of these on the other bed. And then I'll throw on some crude rope. Oh, that looks so nice. And grab the rarest item in the entire game, crow feathers. That way I can pop those in the bed. Oh, that's amazing. Simple bed. I mean, it should be a luxury bed, but that isn't my new spawn point. So I had another big brain idea since there's so many larvae around this thing that this entire upper floor is just gonna be a larval, like, <laughs> trophy room. Although it's kind of creepy, I kind of like it. I mean, I only got like a buttload of larval faces. <laughs> it's surprising how many it takes. <laughs> it's kind of weird. I kind of like it though. Oh no, I ran out of larval faces and wow, that was the perfect amount of acorns that I had too. So this is fun. This is really fun. Hey, <laughs> uh, good thing we have a gigantic stone wall because there's a wolf slider standing right over top of my corpse. Go away. No, ah! no, 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 no. No! Wow. They're so strong. Mr. Wolf Spider, are you still out here in our house? <laughs> right away. Okay. If I can Goomba stomp over the top of the. No. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 <laughs> Why are you eating my wall? Bro. You don't eat my wall. I don't even have my bow to rain down death from above. Maybe I just jump on him. Ah, Geronimo! <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> At least my bed is nice and comfortable. Okay, this place looks amazing from the outside. I love it. I'm just gonna go stack up these boards right here in the nice basement where we got a lot of stuff stacked up. We got that leather couch ready to go. I can keep building more of these. Intern made his chair. Look at that intern. This is your bed over here. You get to sleep in this one and I sleep in this one. Yeah, take your shoes off though. It'll be nice, I promise. Look at that. <laughs> how cool. Oh shoot, I was gonna show you how cool this place looked at night. Okay, check this place out. This is really cool looking. I love it. We have the ladybug face up top. There's like clover growing into the sides and made all of the roofs. I guess we made all of the roofs out of clover. Inside here, we have like a little bit of a garden patch going. Check that out. We're making up some food. Over here, we got our dew collector and this thing is making up a mushroom, probably because they just haven't done the other thing yet, uh, putting in the little mushrooms for food. We have two of those. I don't think we'll use them again because I'm not exactly sure what I'm actually gonna build anything more out of this. But maybe I maybe I should keep going and building more and more and more bricks. I have a feeling the time that I need it, I'll be like, oh, balls, I wish I would've made more. And then we go inside here. It looks a little bit disheveled, a little cluttered, but I kind of like that though. And we got, oh look, is that Kevin? It's not, it's just a random, it's just a random apron, okay. And then you can go over here and then we need one more and it'll be fake Kevin. And we've got, wow. This room is pretty cool. <laughs> I kind of want to put a like a, a fake larva in here, except there is no stuffed larva because why would anyone want that? <laughs> Just right, right guys? Yeah, right. And I can go up on the roof and this place is probably the coolest castle that's ever been built in survival mode of Grounded. I've seen some really cool ones in the creative mode, but like this is legitimate. This is cool. I love it. So there is one more thing I wanted to do here and it's not curate or complete our aphid there. I wanted to run upstairs all the way up outside over here and then this way and then this way. And right on top, we have to build ourselves a flag. There it is. And then we're gonna build it up. Can I name it? I wanna name it. Is there a larva? Cause it's, gonna, it's like castle larva. And then we'll make it this color. Nice. So we did it. <laughs> we created castle base and it's pretty amazing. Check that place out. Yeah, just a little bit up top so we know exactly where it is. That's one cool looking thing. If there's anything that you guys would like to see added to this castle, let me know down below in the comments and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. Ow! And I'd like to thank everyone who signed up on Patreon, including Ben, Ellen Hagen, Dickie James, Apollo Bunny, Otto Dave, Eagle Ark, Whip It Good, Seraphin X, Des Bogger, Maxer, Zarnoff, Legacy, Jason McFarland, Deegan, Paul Longstone, and Ralph. And everyone who has clicked that join button down below to become a YouTube channel member. 